Hello, my name is Jay, and today I'm going to be talking about why we won't be seeing these new 20 cards coming out at least next month in April. Now, I would recommend and I would probably say that it's more likely going to be June, so like summer or something around there. And I'll be explaining like, you know, my logic behind it because obviously we don't have any concrete evidence, but always in the past, and the video has come out and always, you know, given us fair warning that they're going to release cards. They've already come out with all the specs a couple months in advance. And here we are, we're sitting in March with these cards, you know, people are suspecting, these rumors are saying that, you know, we should see something, you know, you know oh rush, I forgot how to count months. But next month, we'll just leave it at that, um, that we're going to be seeing, you know, these cards releasing, and we don't really have any backing behind that. So, basically, online, there's been a lot of those rumors going around, like, you know, hey, they haven't, po you know, there's not enough products out there, there's not enough production going on to really signify that they would be releasing a car, not to mention, and the conferences and stuff, they haven't actually gone through and like, you know, showcased it, meaning that they probably will be pushing it out and releasing it in one of the conferences that will be going on in June or later. So we may not necessarily see these cars too much later. So you're one of those gamers that are, you know, concerned about your 1080 Ti going out of, you know, being the not being necessarily the greatest, uh, latest and greatest, then you're not really, you know, too, shouldn't be too worried, especially because even if these 20 cards come out, if it does anything like we saw with the 1080 Ti, we won't expect to see that um, well after the initial release of the, you know, 80 and the 70 cards. So that's what you could probably still, it, it would, your, the 1080 Ti would be easily bested by the 2080, assuming that they'd still do the 30%, you know, increase. But still, we won't be expecting to see any releases until you know not really as april as we thought but really much more later and i would say that when we start seeing something like you know these spec sheets to start rolling out to see what we can actually expect to see and um pun intended and we start seeing some of the you know actual you know performance you know grades and we start seeing benchmarks and stuff similar to what we're seeing with the ryzen 2 right now i feel like that would be a much better and more likely situation then, you know, we more likely see something really soon rather than, you know, sitting here, everybody speculating, hey, we should see something next month, but we haven't got any benchmarks and we have really no backing behind that. So, yeah. But um, I hope you enjoyed this video. It's relatively short. I just wanted to make this because people are sitting here and they're going, well, you know, why aren't these, why are we not seeing a lot of information? Why is everybody saying this? And I mean, I had videos that I said that April was what we were expecting. Those videos are two months old now. And I mean, hey, I'm coming back here and I'm you know, saying, hey, that's not obviously happening. Um, so, I mean, it really, this is all speculation, but, I mean, there was a lot of, you know, good backing behind it, but then again, you know, conferences here and gone, I mean, yes, there was a lot of cool stuff at the NVIDIA conference, but not really any of those included graphics cards, um, at least the gaming ones that we're looking at, so I feel like, you know, hey, we should see what we get in June with the next conference, because they will most likely unveil at a conference to get the, you know, PR and this, you know, stunt, or you just put the advertisement and stuff. So no one's going to really go about holding off and waiting and doing it in some odd time. So we'll either, you'll definitely see one of the re releases at one of the conferences and we'll know that it's pretty much guaranteed if we see a lot of the, you know, performance benchmarks and stuff popping up on the websites uh, beforehand. So that we'll have a pretty good idea of what cars will be out. Right now, we really don't have any hot card concrete events that it will even be. June, but I would say that that's our next bet. If not June, then hopefully by October or somewhere around there. But I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up. Thank you for watching. Check out my channel there for other cool tech related news. And I think we might be getting some budget computer builds soon. That'd be pretty awesome. But uh, thank you for watching. Peace.